what a lot of men don't understand make sure y'all hit that like button is that women we don't care we just don't because once we walk out the home or once you once we stop once we not in the presence of you we in the presence of another man when we go to work when we go to church when we go to the grocery store when we go to the gym we're always in the presence of another man even online I, I hear men say, I don't want my girl online. Well, she going to meet a man somewhere else? If she's working outside of the home? If she go to the store? She's going to come across the opposite sex. So it doesn't matter. You can't put those restraints on a woman unless she put those restraints on herself. And that's what dealing with you actually wanting more from you. Because we have that end goal. And what's my end goal when I deal with you? What is that end goal? A lot of men say, you know, I just want sex from a woman. Well, she just wants sex too. On top of that, she's trying to put it on you. So she can get whatever she wants. Even if, and with a lot of men, a lot of men believe that if they withdraw sex from a woman, that that will control them. That don't control us. Because we can get a vibrator. We can get another man to get us off. We can get another man to lick us, touch us, suck us, fuck us. That don't mean anything. If we don't sacrifice something to you, it don't mean nothing. And even with that alone, we still get what we want from you and deal with other men. That's how our mind works. Our mind is working so we can always benefit with the men that we're dealing with. With a lot of men, a lot of men don't understand that. Turn that down some. A lot of men don't understand that. A lot of men try to put different restraints on when you're dealing with a woman. The only person you can control is yourself. Unless we want you to control us. So when we listen to all this content, when we read all these books about women... All women are not the same. And all women don't deal with the man for the for, for, for the same reasons. Her reason might be different from my reason. She could be dealing with you to get money. I could be dealing with you to get sex. So it's never going to work. It's up to you when you're dealing with that woman. In that dynamic of dealing with that woman. It ain't going to ever stop us from giving our body away to another man unless we develop that respect factor for you in our head. But we have to come to grip with, you know what? I respect him. I don't want to be with another man. I, I just don't want to do it. But I have to, I have to put it in my mind. You know, I have to see you as something I never came across. And even then, fam, even with that mindset, we still would give our body away to another man. We still, because if there's something lacking when dealing with you, we're going to try to find that in another man. You get what I'm saying? And the things you care about, we don't. We don't care about that. We, we just don't care. Men always try to. I know this with a lot of men. And I'm a mod. I'm going to have a mod. But I got to see who's going to be a mod. I need I need one. At least two mods on this channel. I'm, I'll mod some people up the more I start going live. But it's kind of like this fam. Men try to build this delusion. When I listen to some of these men. They're more delusional than the women. Because I'll sit back and I'll say, okay, I see what men are talking about. I see how men play games on women. Your woman can go on YouTube and find the same shit you listen to. Your woman can read the same books you read. That's why I did that video of men underestimating women. Because a lot of men, they underestimate the ability of a woman to get what she wants. It doesn't matter. Doesn't matter what you say, doesn't matter what you do. As long as I get what I can get from you, that's all that matters. I don't care about anything else. 
So while you working on yourself, while you building yourself, I, I don't care about that. All I care about is what I, whatever I can receive from you. You can try your hardest. It doesn't matter. Because if I can get to my end goal, if I can execute the relationship or whatever I want from you, I'm going to do that. And it doesn't matter what you say. It doesn't matter what you do. Yes, I'll pretend with you to make you think you got one up on me. And then I'll go in for the kill. And what's the kill? Whatever I want from you. Men underestimating women's abilities when they're dealing with her. Understand women have power. And we know that. We know we have power. It is is women don't lie about it. You can go around YouTube and listen to women content. Listen to where they talk about men. Women are not stupid. Women are not dumb. Women are emotional. Women are sensitive. Yes, I I can't lie about those two things because they are that. You get what I'm saying? So it's kind of like the more you think that it's easy for you to get what you want from a woman, you're going to always find yourself running in circles when it comes to women, when it comes to a woman, because we're going to always try to throw a monkey wrench in a dynamic between me and you. So you don't get totally everything you want from me. Because the moment you can, you get everything you want from me, I'm going to sit back and say, hold on. I gave this man this, 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 this. I sacrificed this, 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 this. I got to go back and regroup so I can gain some of that power back. If she truly wants to be in your life, she going to fight. She going to sacrifice. She ain't going to give her body to another man, but it's up to that woman that you're dealing with. You get what I'm saying? All that don't work on all women. Some women have fathers. Some women didn't have fathers. Some women were molested. Some women wasn't molested. Some women have brothers and sisters. Some women don't have brothers and sisters. Some women have a, a father that's influencing her life right now, even at the age of 60. So what makes you think that ideology that you learned is going to work on me? If, we, if you're dealing with two different types of women, when one woman could actually care or want to be with you and one woman don't give a fuck, she might look better. You get what I'm saying? So it doesn't matter. It really doesn't. Then it has a lot to do with the woman that you deal with, the woman that you entertain, the woman that you give your energy to, her age, her knowledge. Get what I'm saying, fam? I'm trying to break it down the best way I can so you can actually understand the mind of a woman and the way we think. I might wake up one morning and say, I'm giving my entire existence to you. And the moment I see a crack or the moment I can doubt your ability to be a man for me, I might walk away. Because the man at the store, he's been flirting with me. Or the man at the gym, he's been, he's been really giving me that energy I need. Get what I'm saying? So it's kind of like men placing so much. I'm not going to even say value because they use that word so loosely. Giving a woman energy, time, and etc. Building this woman... You know, you know, you try to dominate this woman. You you're dominating her. But we can still find a crack. Women are not stupid. Women just don't give a fuck. It's up to the woman that you deal with. If she wants to be a part of you, 